That is Brian Bayo 0 and 1 and 982 ERA recalled from Triple A Worcester just yesterday. And away we go as Stephen Kwan steps in and smash up the middle and Stephen Kwan just like last night starts the game off with a base hit to center field. And the Guardians have Ahmed Rosario coming to the plate in a 2 for 15 slide up the middle. Here's Valdez feeding Royal for one and got him double play Turner hanging on to the bag. And the Red Sox turn two. Jose comes in with a hit in three straight games. Yeah, there's a base hit in the right field, and Jose Ramirez has hit now in four straight games. And he's had three straight two one counts. Josh Naylor drove in a run with a sack fly last night. Taken off again. Swung on a miss. Strike three. Got him with that changeup. Double play certainly helped, and the Red Sox are coming up. Well, Zach Plesak on the mound here, starting game two of this series, making his fifth start this year. One on one record, 6.50 ERA. Verdugo launching the first one, high deep drive into left field. Quan underneath, and that ball is off the wall. And in the second, easily Verdugo, he's got himself a double. Quan trying to deke, but it winds up two bases for the leadoff man. Turner fans, the runners do not advance. Runners at first and second with one down for Raffi, who's hit was in his last 12 at bats. There's a drive. Look at this one, Carey. Way, way back. And that ball is gone. And he killed it. Raphael with number 10 and a three run blast. And the Red Sox quickly get on the board. Well, so much for a little slump. Yeah, the two guys have been held down a little bit. Are Jumping in this inning with big hits. Verdugo leading it off, and man, Raffi fouled off that pitch to get to this one and absolutely crushed it. Josh Bell leads off the second inning for the Guardians. There's a ball hammered deep left center field, up uh -oh. and gone. A home run for Josh Bell. An opposite field monster clearing homer for Bell. That's his third on the year. And the Red Sox lead is now three to one. Boy, that's a nice way to come back and answer with one swing of the bat for Bell. It's his third homer, and a third home run allowed by Bayo. Tasker Gonzalez getting the start in right field. Gonzalez, a trickler, Devers to charge the bare hand. Oh, that's a beautiful play. Sensational play by Raphael on the defensive side and one away. Yeah, Raphael came to play today. After having that home run, you get a little more confident, a little excited. Then a nice little bare hand do or die. Rafi Devers is yet to make an error at third base. Like Rafi's just been so good at third. Jimenez is down on strikes, two away. Two down, there's Mike Zanino. Base is clean. Swung on and missed. That one tied him up inside at 96 for strike three. Sox up 3 1 on the Guardians. Yoshida to lead things off here. And Yoshida trying to launch one yeah. off the wall. He will. Yeah. And Juan makes a good throw to second base. They got him if they get the tag on, and they do, says second base umpire C.B. Buckner. I mean, you talk about the ball beat Yarch. Well, they did, but what happened to Quan is that ball hit a hard spot up there, and it bounced past him, but it still got his momentum going forward, and he was out. They can't challenge that. That was a great play by uh, by Quan. Good throw. Well defended there by Quan. Ramirez five for six stealing bases. Josh Naylor steps in. He struck out his first time up. The runner goes. Here's the throw down by Wong, Got and he is out. Cut down. Wong gets another one. He's really been very good back there. He's thrown out six out of 11 attempting to steal. And there's a line drop base hit. So back to back singles here in the fourth for the Guardians. There's Josh Bell. Swing and a miss. And that throw is not in time. A stolen base for Josh Naylor. That's his second on the year. Now there's two down, but the Guardians have a base runner in scoring position. Went back to the heat at 97 and struck him out. Despite the two hits, nothing doing here for the Guardians. One out base runner in scoring position. Here's N. Manuel Valdez. Fly down the left field line, headed toward the wall. Quan's on the move again, and that catches more of the green. Here comes the run. Tapia will score, and Valdez has another double. He's liking the walls here, and it's four to one. Christian Arroyo granted a short his first time up. This one's up the middle for a single. Valdez hitting third. Straw firing home. It's going to be cut off. Another run scores, and the Sox lead it five to one. 
Three consecutive hits here in the fourth inning. Connor Wong, he ripped the only pitch he saw in the second inning up the middle for a base hit. There's another one hard hit. That'll drop down for a single. Charged by Quan. Throw comes quickly into second base. Not in time to get a Royal. It's four consecutive hits. And here comes Tito, and that's it for police sack. Red Sox lead it five to one. Consecutive walks, and that brings up Rosario. A little bit of trouble here for Bayo. And a little dribbler here, a swinging butt. Bayo will throw, and that's a nice play to get him. Nice play by Turner, too. Over there at first base, and that'll retire the side. Two on, two out for Valdez, who drove in his first major league run. Swung nice. out and missed, boy, Curry. Nice pitching to get out of trouble. Red Sox strand a pair. We move to the sixth. Boston five. Now there are runners at the corners. Masataka Yoshida to the plate. Here's the throw down by Zanino. Go, go, it's off go. into center field. Here comes the run. Arroyo will score. Here's the throw to third and safe. Zanino with a misfire to cost them. And the Red Sox lead it six to one. Red Sox with a five run lead. Jimenez has struck out fly down. Down the line it goes. Around Pesky's pull. Oh, it's a home run for Andres Jimenez. That'll be his second on the year. Second of the day for the Guardians. And they cut the Red Sox lead to 6-2. Jimenez gets his second homer of the year in one swing. It's a breaking ball he left inside. Well, here comes Schreiber. Suddenly, the Guardians have the bases loaded with two outs. Naylor has had a knack for coming up in clutch situations and delivery. Rip to right field, fair ball. Kicks off the sidewall. Straw scores. Quad scores. Here comes Jose Ramirez. They're going to wave him around. Throw to the plate. Nowhere close. Josh Naylor go. clears the bases here in the seventh inning, and we got a ball game at Fenway. And that's a one run ball game. Well, wow. the Red Sox know this is the ball game right here. They got Jose Ramirez coming up. Tying run at second base. Great speed at both second and first. And Jose with a line drive base in center field. That'll get the tying run home. Quad hits second and jams on the brakes. He'll hold at second base. We got a tie ball game on the first run allowed by Kenley Jansen this year. And no surprise, it's Jose Ramirez with his third hit. That loads him up for Emmanuel Valdez, who got his first major league RBI in the fourth inning. Right field, Brennan. We got extra innings. Eli Morgan continues his fantastic start to the year. Ten scoreless outings for the right-hander. And now it's up to Mike Zanino. Go ahead, run. Still out there at second. And a line drive base hit left field. Coming around third to score is Arias. Zanino will hold with a go-ahead RBI single, Boy. and it's seven-six Cleveland. Clutch hit right there. Manuel Valdez is the zombie runner at second, and here's Arroyo. Round ball up the middle and through for a base hit. Valdez rounding, and Straw won't throw it, and the Red Sox have tied the game. Christian Arroyo in a three hit day and now evening has made it 7 7. So a sacrifice bunt brings up Verdugo. Chance to get the Red Sox in the win column. It's a wild one, and how about this? To the backstop. And all the way down to third is Arroyo. The 2 0. And a base hit into left field. Here comes the run, and the Red Sox win it. They win it in 10. Verdugo strikes again. He drives in Christian Arroyo, and the Red Sox win it 8 7.